It was a moment not to be missed. We just decided to come out and be a part of Tacoma history. Kathy Jo brought her dog Angel Eyes. On the last day, the outer loop of Five Mile Drive was open to cars. I've been here probably a thousand times and I just love it. The love for Five Mile Drive was clear by the stop and go traffic. It took some people an hour to make the trip and see those familiar views. Sad. I am heartbroken. Jessica and Debbie Hill already planned a big day. I'm going to pick up my wedding dress right now and I was like, I gotta stop because it's got, you know, it's it's a staple. <laughs> I had to do it. <laughs> I've been coming here for over 60 years. Metro Parks Tacoma announced this week the outer loop would close to cars. From Chopper 7, you can see the concern. A geotech report detailed how the hillside at the tip of Point Defiance is eroding, moving closer to the 100-year-old roadway. When that road was built, there was a whole lot more real estate between the roadway edge and, and the embankment to the beach below. Officials say rising sea level and more intense rain from climate change is exacerbating erosion and forcing tough decisions. The outer loop will now open only to walkers and cyclists until officials make an access plan for people with impaired mobility. Obviously we can walk out here and hike out here and that's going to be new and exciting because we're not going to have to worry about the cars. But um, this is, you like to drive down here, turn on your music, enjoy the sunshine. After the gates close for the last time promptly at 2 p.m., 94-year-old Lowell Larson rode in the final car. It's a pretty historic time 